<laughs> you just can't. <laughs> Sorry about that. My you, fault. You just can't beat the classic on Classic Country 900 WKDW. Hey, this is Colton. <laughs> this is Chris. I think I just probably made you deaf over there. <laughs> I didn't turn off the CD in time. I tried to start the tape recorder, the camera, and stop the uh, CD all at the same time, and I didn't have enough arms. <laughs> Only have two. And I couldn't reach this up here with my feet. So. I was trying. <laughs> that was a sight, I bet. <laughs> <laughs> Are you doing okay this morning? Yeah. Are you having fun? Yes. You've been with me, this is your second time you've been with me this summer. Third. Third overall. Yeah. Over the last couple of years. and I think we're having more fun today than ever before. Yes. <laughs> uh, like I said, every time I look over at you, you got this little card, and you're holding your hand up in the air or pointing or trying to get my attention so I don't talk before you do. <laughs> then I let the CD roll and blast your drums out. <laughs> but I am having a good time with you. Colton is with us this morning. That was a fishing biting from David Lee Murphy. Over the weekend, like I said, spent the day on Saturday fishing with Dalton. And you were telling me that you've never been fishing either. Mm -mm. I don't know. I think I could get to enjoy it. If you're not catching anything, I don't think it's a lot of fun. Yeah, it's not. <laughs> Wait. But I kind of like the, the peacefulness and the serenity and the quiet right there. Like I said, we had a fantastic time on Saturday. Um... You and I, we were talking about hanging out and so forth. You and I had the chance to spend the day together oh, about a month ago. Yep. It was just after the 4th of July that next weekend. And we took a road trip. Near Washington, D.C. Yes, went up near Washington, D.C. to uh, Jiffy Lube Live, which used to be the Nissan Pavilion, for a concert. And you had never been to like a big concert before either, had you? No. And who did we see that night? Lady Antebellum, Love and Thug, and... Tim McGraw. Tim McGraw. <laughs> you like Lady Antebellum the best, though. Yeah. By far. That's why I named it first. <laughs> yeah, I kind of figured that's who you remembered <laughs> the first. But we did make the trip up there, and we saw them, and had really good seats. Yeah. Right there near, I guess you call it a runway, where they would yeah. walk down. And got some really good pictures and uh, video of, uh, of you being there. You seemed to really have a good time there, too. Mm -hmm. It was a long, tiring day, but it was a lot <laughs> of fun. And uh, you actually got a few souvenirs while you were there, didn't you? Yep. A toothpick um, from Lady Antebellum. Wait, wait, wait. Not a toothpick. I mean... <laughs> <laughs> you didn't get a I mean, a guitar pick from <laughs> Lady Antebellum and Love and Stuff. I was going to say, I didn't see anybody throwing out toothpicks that <laughs> night, but you did. You actually got uh, guitar picks from both of them. Yep. Pretty cool little souvenir to have as they threw them off the stage. Yeah. So, anyway, I thought, to kind of remember that, because that, that's the most fun we've ever had together. That was a blast. That was, that was like the longest that we hung out. <laughs> it definitely was. <clears throat> Didn't get you home till like the middle of the night there. Sunday morning. At like time. one. It was, it was, I don't even remember what day. It was late though. Yeah. But uh, anyway, to remember all the fun we had, I thought we'd do maybe three songs here coming up. We'll do Love and Theft. Lady Antebello and Tim McGraw. Yeah, we'll do them all three coming up and I'll get you to check the forecast too.